Yeah, blow, uh, big up to knots, holding it down. Assassin on the top of Paul Hastings, trying to chase Manhattan. I blew a euro in front of the bureau, passed the package. I had to wrap it, though I had no prophylactics. I promote the hat trick. Magic Johnson made a basket. Black presidential info passes to the masses. Black markers, black starter jackets. The black market crashes. Gold rolls on my watch, though. I put my palm on the Bible and I spoke. Gospel live show thread. What up, gamers? It's your boy King Thrash back at it once again with another video. Remember to like, subscribe. If you don't like, don't subscribe. Have your girl come through trying to play the game and you're like, cool, this is a good opportunity to get this bitch into gaming so we can share this and you can have that magic gaming marriage until that bitch asks you how to play Call of Duty and this bitch don't know how to move and look at the same goddamn time and you get frustrated because you're like, bitch, use both your thumbs, bitch. Use both your thumbs, goddamn. Aim, don't worry about aiming right now, bitch. Learn to walk, do what you do. You gotta tell him. I mean, you're not calling her a bitch the whole time. This is this is in your head. Don't call your girl a bitch because you're not gonna get away with it. Say it in your head. But you know damn well you think it's a good idea at first. But then come to find out it was a frustrating as fuck idea because you like, damn, this bitch can't even walk around. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good though, baby. It's all good. You good at Mario Kart. Stick to Mario Kart, nigga. Shit, do what you do. Let's get on with this game of news. Ah, I got my drink out today. So you know some you know some niggas on some real shit, nigga. I got my drink out because you know, these Xbox fanboys quiet as fuck. Y'all did y'all notice the quietness? I noticed the shit. I live right next door to an Xbox nigga, quiet as fuck. The nigga don't get no pussy, don't play no games, but nigga, I don't even hear Netflix. Nothing, no movies, nothing, quietness. It goes on with what I've been saying for a long ass time. Because nigga, my Nostradamus game is on point. Nigga, my shit is on point, non-stop. Nigga, I played the lotto, nigga, I played. I lost. I guess I don't got that kind of Nostradamus to where I could win the lotto. I guess that's the motherfucking curse. But when it comes to this game shit, nigga, my shit is on point. You see, I told y'all niggas. Nigga, talent trumps power. I've said this a thousand million times. I said the Xbox One X is a powerful, awesome console. It is. But the people making the game for it, the niggas is kindergartners, nigga. These niggas, these these niggas don't got they driving permits. You know what I'm saying? They not, they not. Think about it. Just think about it, though, my nigga. The Xbox and their first party studios have the youngest first party studios making their games, and therefore they don't know the tricks of the trade. They don't know different techniques and moves. You know what I'm saying? These niggas. These niggas ain't the Bruce Lee of gaming, my nigga. Hell, they not even Chuck Norris. No. No, these niggas is 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 Dan levels of Kung Fu, my nigga. Dan from Street Fighter levels of competition. You understand what I'm saying? The Xbox One X best looking game. Forza Motorsports. Best looking launch game it has, and honestly, the best looking game on Xbox are racing games. Like that shit or not. Forza Horizon 3 is a beautiful fucking game. It's beautiful as fuck. Sexy. Ass, titties, all that. Well, it's 30 frames per second, so. I mean, but still, I mean, I don't give a fuck about that, that part, my nigga. I mean, it's understandable why. But Forza Motorsports 7 that's coming out right now is... 60 frames a second, 4K native, no drops, I don't think, I think, I'm not sure, I gotta, I gotta check that out, 4K third, 4K 60, for this, for the entirety of this year, especially after Scalebound got cancelled, for the entirety of this year, Xbox fanboys have been comparing Gran Turismo Sport 
to Forza Motorsports. That's all they've been talking about, how it's better. They said that for uh, Gran Turismo was going to be 1440p checkerboard rendered to 4K. Xbox fanboys was like, nigga, our shit is native 4K. Oh my God, my nipples are hard. These niggas' nipples was hard. You can see, you can see the, 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 the nipple hardness through the neon green shirts they had. They was happy. Day after day after day, they said, 1440p, Forza is the new king of racers. The new king. Now, I'm not talking about the fucked up ass microtransactions that they have in Forza. Because apparently that's okay. I made a video about that shit already. It's all good. No, I'm talking about the visuals. I'm talking about the sexy. You see, Gran Turismo Sports Beta is about to come out. And on top of that, they had an update. The 1.8, I believe it is. 1.08. And, uh... Why is that shit destroying every game? And it's not even 4K. Hmm? I ask you, fanboys of Xbox. Where are your videos talking about this comparison? Huh? You see, Gran Turismo just exposed everything about the Xbox One X. Every strength that it had. Its best looking game. Its power has been compromised with Gran Turismo and nobody talking about it. But you know how the king do, my niggas. You know how the king... Hold on, nigga. Let me get my Xbox flip-flops on. Let me see how I feel. Let me put these motherfuckers on, cuz. Mm, mm, nigga. Let me feel... Let me... Let me... Let me... Let me sit in my Xbox flip-flops. These motherfuckers is black because I'm a goddamn G and I ain't walking around in no goddamn... Neon green sandals. Nigga, what the fuck do I look like? I live in the hood. Going outside wearing no goddamn lime green. The cops will see that shit ASAP. Nigga. I can't wear my PlayStation ones because they blue and I'm in the wrong hood. Nah, <laughs> nah, I'm fucking, fucking around. But nah, no, nah, real shit though. No, nah, no, nah, real shit. No, nah, nigga, hold on, hold on, relax. Relax. Especially y'all Xbox fanboys. Have you seen the footage? I know you've seen the footage. I know you have. Where, where are the Xbox articles at that's showing this shit off, huh? It was, it's been so many. I've I seen perfect scores for Forza for some reason. Perfect. It's a perfect game. Gran Turismo better get all 10s then. You see, 4K don't mean shit but resolution. Resolution ain't shit but sharpness. It has nothing, and I mean nothing, to do with the, the, the overall look of a game. It's only a piece of it. It's only making the things that look good on screen look sharper. You know what I'm saying? You can see further in the background of sharpness. There is only a slight blur that you have to zoom in on and stand next to your TV to see a difference between Gran Turismo's resolution and Forza's resolution. But you know what you don't gotta, gotta, gotta go up to the TV to look at? exactly the graphical beauty of each game and y'all niggas know I got screenshots nigga nigga I got screenshots for days for days look at these screenshots mind you this isn't on the Xbox One X let me get this shit out the way first this screenshot isn't a comparison of Gran Turismo Sports on a Pro versus the Xbox One X it's not this is Forza, I said Gran Turismo twice, didn't I? I'm getting faded. I'm already versus Forza. Now, Forza is on a PC at max settings. You know what I'm saying? A PC at max settings. The kind of look. The kind of barren and dry and toyish it looks in comparison. At first, these cars was looking great, wasn't they? Wasn't these cars looking bomb as fuck at one point? They still look bomb as fuck. The problem is, it's being compared to a better looking game. No matter how you flip it, no matter how you squeeze it, 
Nigga, no matter how how much ketchup you squeeze on the hamburger, that hamburger is still dry as a motherfucker. You see, I'm not a racing nigga, cuz. I don't I don't like racing games. Cause I've been said this shit. I'm not a racer type nigga. I'm not giving a fuck about nigga tuning cars and, and putting rent. I don't give a fuck, nigga. I drive a goddamn hash hatchback Toyota Toyota looking car in Grand Theft Auto, nigga. I ain't juiced my shit up. For what? Point A to point B when that's the type of nigga I'm is, nigga. They get the fuck out of here, nigga. My girl got a better looking car than me. You crazy, nigga? Even though I'm a, uh, you gotta get a whip out here. I'm Cali, nigga. I'm getting my, I got a car, but and it's a nice car, but I, I ain't got a G car, nigga. Gonna be fucked up, but still, nigga. As far as car games go, the, the the best I'm doing is Mario Kart. You got me fucked up. It's a genre that that just doesn't tickle my motherfucking fancy. And just because Gran Turismo is shitting on the Forza, I ain't gonna act like I'm a racer, nigga. Now, but I'm gonna tell you, niggas, this. I always said, nigga, the, the niggas at at fucking um, I don't even know who make Gran Turismo. That's how bad. That's how bad it is. I don't even know who make this motherfucker. But I know them niggas is talented as fuck. They've been doing this shit for years. Like I said, the Xbox niggas, them niggas is baby niggas. They developers, they babies in this game, my nigga. These niggas is babies in this game. These niggas been making Gran Turismo look sexy for decades, not years. Decades. Nigga, I'm talking PS1 days, just shitting on niggas. PS2 days, shitting on niggas. They had photorealistic fucking cars back in the PS2 days. Understand what I'm saying? The PS Vita shit look nice. These niggas, I don't know if they made the Vita version, but still, my nigga. I mean, th- when you when you hear Gran Turismo, you hear one of the best-selling games ever created. These developers know what the fuck they're doing and why they're doing it. These niggas said fuck 4K. Because we want our game to look beautiful. That's what they did, my nigga. They said fuck 4K. We want our game to look beautiful. Because it's like I've been saying, sharpness don't mean shit if your game don't look right. I've always said Minecraft in 4K is still Minecraft in 4K. It's still a blocky, ugly ass game. It's just the blocks are that much sharper, nigga. Horizon Zero Dawn, not in 4K, one of the best looking games ever created. You have a direct comparison now. You couldn't say, oh, we're going to compare Horizon 2. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's nothing on Xbox you can really compare Horizon to. It's not. There ain't no lush open world jungles and, and Gears of War, nigga. Fuck, nigga, Gears of War don't even got a game that don't got guns in it. Every game they got is either a racing game or a gun type game with guns in it. But right here, you got a direct comparison to where you can compare everything from, from the tracks to the cars. And looking at these comparisons, Gran Turismo has destroyed them. Destroyed. You can, they're saying some people are saying that the Xbox X version. Looks better than the PC version. I, 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 don't, I don't see that happening, but even if it does look better, it is not going to catch this. I remember that, that Project Cars argument, too, about 4K. Oh, this is going to be better than Gran Turismo because this is 4K, too. Remember that shit, Xbox fanboys? Well, look at that comparison. Look at that shit. Nigga, is that balloons on the Gran Turismo? Gran Turismo got more shit popping in their backgrounds. Backgrounds mean a lot to a racing game. The tracks are just as important as the cars. And they cars are ultra detailed. The homie Big Money said he heard they've been working on each car for six months. Each car. Each car got six months worth of detailed time. These cars are looking like fucking toy cars in comparison, my nigga. It's like having... A bowl of chips and and powdered guacamole then having some tortilla chips made fresh from tortillas with homemade guacamole made with actual avocados red peppers onions lime squeeze squeeze the lime squeeze it and relax that's what the grand grand turismo nigga is killing the game off so nice you see, Forza, Forza is Wonder Woman 
All right? Old girl, beautiful as fuck. That's Forza. It's nice. Gran Turismo is that same bitch, except she got ass and titties. Now, just add ass and titties to this bitch. You know what I'm saying? Like, proper ass and titties. Don't make it all too big. Just make it nice. Nice. Shaped. Shaped. Again, you got extra, extra bells and whistles to play with. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's the problem. That's the problem. Like, I've been telling y'all niggas, that's the problem with this whole situation. It's the talent of the developers that matter. A game could be 4K, it could be 1080p. I would take, look at, look at how Destiny played out on, on PC, how it looked way better because it was 1080p, 60 frames per second on PCs. And people were liking that mode better than, better than the 4K 31. And that, that don't have really nothing to do with the develop the, the, the talent of the developers. It just goes to show that when you when y'all niggas talk about 4K, are y'all talking about the correct 4K? And and I know your argument about saying that when when the PS4 was 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 more powerful than the Xbox One, what it still is, um, and, and and niggas was talking about how some games were 1080p and some games weren't. I always said I already know it's about the price of the Xbox One. But let's just say you be going with that argument though, my nigga. At the end of the day, though, Microsoft didn't have good developers to go along with their fucking 900p. They just didn't. They don't. They they never will. They never will. If they were, they would have done it already. They never will. They they are dependent on third-party games, and that's gonna be even worse for them because all that power is gonna go to waste. And all these fanboys are going to do, they just going to ignore it, my nigga. They just going to ignore it. You want to let me let me show y'all niggas something sexy before I go. Let me show y'all niggas what I mean about how 4K is damaging the Xbox because of no talent. Turn 10 is a talented developer. Don't get me wrong, but they not talented like that. Or they just being forced. This is what's really going to hurt Microsoft as as far as forcing um um, 4K on, on the on, on their developers. Take a look at these screenshots that I got for y'all niggas. We got Forza 5, right? This is uh, I forgot the name of the track. All right, but you know this is a this is a track on Forza 5 uh, HD screenshot. All right, that's Forza 5. That's four years ago. Now let's go to Forza 6. Forza 6. It looks. Slightly worse. A little bit washed a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Same track, same area, same grass, same everything. It looks different, but it doesn't look better. Now look at Forza 7. Same track, same area, same time of day. Looking like shit. Fucking grassed and died. Just took out all the graphical graphical fidelity in order to to keep a steady frame rate at 4K. Is that does that look like no compromise to you? Huh? Cause that shit for sure look like compromise to me. If the Xbox One one terabyte console got tracks looking better on it than you do on your six terabyte console. It's it's starting to show, and 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 it seems like Microsoft can't catch a break. That's like 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 the homie Big Money said, Microsoft can't catch a break, because as soon as they come out, they this whole entire year, my nigga, they've been talking about 4K games and and the power of the Scorpio, and then there was the power of the Xbox One the X when E3 came, and everybody was talking that shit. Then boom, Crackdown gets fucking um, pushed back, and and just like scale. Um, See it stay today and stay the K and see it these leaving only Forza as their only triple A game that's actually a real triple A game to come out this year. And I don't even know if we can call sports games triple A games, but still, it's 4K, it is 60 frames per second. But Gran Turismo comes out right after. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's like, and then Gran Turismo comes out right after on a weaker console, destroying it at sub 4K. At at Checkerboard 4K. 
it's things it's things like this my nigga is why I fuck with PlayStation because not only do they give me what I want as a gamer not only do they have a much larger broad strand of games they have some of the most de talented developers in gaming in different genres you know what I'm saying not just one genre do they have a good no in all genres and then they have dynamic developers they have their developers bring their talent and bring and make a whole nother genre and destroy that look at Killzone the first party motherfucker with Guerrilla Games with first person game first person shooters my nigga and then next thing you know these niggas go and make Horizon a third person dinosaur versus arrow game look at Naughty Dog going from a platformer and, and, and Crash Bandicoot to, to go into a a, um, a story open world shooter in Jack and Daxter then to go into a, a story driven cinematic third person cover shooter all with ease all dynamic and deadly now they went into horror and shit these niggas going into survival horror and shit like that you know what I'm saying dynamic shit it is what it is and it does what it does These niggas is talented. They got talented people behind them. And I, I and, uh, and hold on, let me let me debunk one more little. This is a, this is some bonus debunk shit, nigga. Bonus debunkers, nigga. I know I got a, a a debunk video coming up. You know what I'm saying for Xbox debunk debunk little they little debunked facts that they lie about part two, little shit that they use to brag about. I debunked all they bullshit. I got part two of that shit coming up, but let me give you a little sample of some uh, a little a little shit. Recently, I mean, not recently, but the number one the number one thing Xbox niggas would say about games that were that were coming out sub 4K, they would say, "Oh, it's developer's choice." Oh, Microsoft said that it's developer's choice; they can do what they want to do. That's why that's why these games aren't coming out. It's not that the Xbox One X isn't powerful enough; it's that you know that that Microsoft gave him choice, and I'm like, wait a minute, cuz like, didn't Mark Cerny give them niggas that same choice? Didn't he mention that same exact shit? Didn't he say that shit? He said that the developers can either choose to go 4K or they can choose to use the second board 4K or they can choose to do whatever the fuck else they want to do with the power of the of the PlayStation Pro. Of course, I, I'm not saying that these games can be 4K. I'm just saying that that power of choice oh it's not 4k because they choose not to be 4k and Microsoft said they don't got to be 4k I, no, I, I don't I don't I don't buy that shit you know what I'm saying like nah it's it's not this be real my nigga it's not these games uh, there are there are not coming out in 4k on the Xbox One X aren't coming out in 4k because they don't have the the power to do so nor the talent they don't have the power nor the talent. Making it, giving you a powerful console does not give you more talent. You just suck. Period, nigga. Gran Turismo has exposed the console, and them niggas is quiet as fuck about it because they know it's exposed. That's all I gotta say about that motherfucking shit right now, nigga. I'm about to go get me some motherfucking nigga, um, some motherfucking salmon, nigga, grilled with lemon and blackened. Nigga, blackened lemon motherfucking salmon, nigga. With garlic butter, nigga. Nigga. What's that shit called? Long grain rice, but it's something else. Placebo rice. Nigga. <laughs> Placebo rice. <laughs> Was it fake rice? <laughs> nigga. Shit, nigga. I ain't doing peanut butter sandwiches with my drink today, nigga. Got me fucked up, nigga. That's Xbox lunch, nigga. Peanut butter and jelly bullshit. Nigga. Four, 4K. But but ugly 4K, nigga. That's what I'm gonna start calling them motherfuckers, nigga. I, like like I said, that console was slightless, nigga. It's slightly better with less games. And at this point right here, it's not even slightness, nigga. It's just less, nigga. It's less pretty, less games. Black ass motherfucking console, cuz. Fuck out of here, cuz. Keep dress gaming, signing off. Like, subscribe. Don't like, don't subscribe. Be in a situation where you gotta choose between your girl and the game, and without hesitation, you choose your game because you a real ass motherfucking gamer, nigga. Do what you do. I love my girl. It's just I love my game even more. I'm glad you don't watch my videos, nigga. Real shit, nigga. Do what you do. I'm gone.